This is not the first time a player's done this. And so, you know, I'm looking forward to the 2015 season. And I think so is Philip. And so everything else is, is all speculation right now, as Antonio Gates said. Um, so, we, you know, we, we plan on Philip re retiring a Charger. We've said Tom Telesco has said that a number of times. Not the first time it's happened with a quarterback situation, but Philip Rivers is different. It's a Pro Bowl guy who's played his entire year in San Diego, and he's basically made himself into a lame duck quarterback. Well, what he's doing is he wants to retire a Charger. He may not want to retire a, Sandy, a Los Angeles Charger. He'd love to be able to go in San Diego. He likes to keep his options open if the team moves to Los Angeles. But from the team standpoint, they have a couple options to try to keep him if he doesn't sign a contract. They can franchise him for two years, and the number is going to roughly work out to be in the first couple of years what he would make in a long-term deal. So there's no panic from the Chargers standpoint, but there's a reluctance right now from Rivers to possibly move to Los Angeles. Hey, people don't turn down money. That's why they call it money, right, Ed? So this is an obviously a situation that's in flux, and the Marcus Mariota situation vis-a-vis -vis the San Diego Chargers has some interplay here, does it not? Yeah, in terms of Phillip Rivers being traded to a team like uh, the Titans, who have the second overall pick. Ken Wesenhunt, obviously a former Chargers assistant coach who worked with Phillip Rivers and knows him well. Uh, obviously, talking to Mike McCoy, he has a very strong sense that Phillip Rivers isn't going anywhere, especially uh, at this point in time. Although, you know, you wouldn't expect him to admit a quarterback was available for a trade. But I certainly think that if he were available, Ken Wisenhunt would have interest in reuniting with him. Now, keep in mind, you know, people didn't think Phillip Rivers was an elite quarterback uh, at the time that Mike McCoy exactly. came into the, to the league as a head coach no with the Chargers. He made this player into a great quarterback again. And so I don't think we should lose sight of that.